hello everyone welcome to unify study in this video i am going to discuss about the question of toc that is the theory of computation question from ugc net 2020 so if you are preparing for ugc net or gate or any other competitive exam if toc there in your syllabus then this video is for you and if you are new to this channel then please subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon to get all the notice notification because there we are giving you the free content free video free solution free live classes for computer science UGC net and for paper one also and gate and other exam also so it is a complete uh, solution for computer science and the UGC net paper one computer science gate UGC net and other exam also so let's see uh, the question of the TOC so actually in TOC there was 10 question in UGC net so I have divided the question topic wise in this video I will discuss the regular expression the question was from regular expression that is the regular expression was given and from that you have to identify that which one is superset and which one is subset. So what is star what is plus everything I am going to discuss here. So please watch this video till the end and don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon. This is about myself I am Priyanka Chatterjee. UGC net qualified with 99.46 percentile and I am a an academy educator also you can follow me there also there also I am taking the free live classes at 7 pm so you can follow me this is my profile of an academy just search my profile Priyanka Chatterjee you will see the profile and here you can follow me okay here I am taking the free live classes for computer science and UGC net paper 1 at 7 pm okay and this is my referral code for Priyanka CS you can use the Priyanka CS if you want to join the UGC net subscription then you will get 10% off using my referral code. So now come to the question without wasting time. So this was the question number one I can say this was uh, as per our analysis this is the question number one from the regular expression. So there was the regular expression given one two three three regular expression was given and the question is that that what which one is superset and which one is subset so i think you all know which one is superset and subset that superset subset means that super means uh, you can easily understand that a greater or equals to b right that is actually means you can write let down lag that that a b so now which one is superset that a is the superset and b is the subset so what is the meaning of superset superset means whatever content is there whatever element whatever content is there in b it is there in a but more than that means it is b plus something more right whatever there in b that will be supported by a but in a there are some extra thing that is actually the concept of superset and subset right so now how you can approach this question here you have to understand that which are the uh, string you can generate from everyone which are the string right that is we have to understand so here uh, when for that you have to understand another thing that what is star and what is plus star means what that is the any combination of means when there is bracket or when there is not bracket also if it is a star like that star means that any combination of the alphabet including null means including lambda we are saying lambda what is lambda means there can be no occurrence also means a can not means there can be no occurrence no occurrence is there means it can be lambda that is we are telling if so a star means there is the extra is that is the lambda can be there that is no occurrence and after that any combination of a right but the plus is meaning that at least one occurrence should be there at least one occurrence so if it is a star then at least one a should be there after that there can be multiple a so that is the concept of star and plus now you can think like that key here here it is b plus a and after that there was the star means what is the meaning that inside here can be this inside part can be lambda and after that there can be the any combination of a or b here is the plus this plus is meaning that or 
so any combination of a or b can be there inside that so if you write down this in that way so what it is that lambda can be there and after that any combination of a or b right this is coming here from this star so here what the the string you can generate that at least one a from this one from this one this a at least one a should be there after that it can be lambda and after that any combination of a b means a a can be there a b can be there a a a b can be there anything can be there right so at least one a is there now from here from here try to understand that from this one a is there and here a plus b means a or b but there is plus means it is the meaning the lambda cannot be there and after that any combination of a or b right so at least one a is there after that either a or b means a b or a a should be there means here at least one character is this lambda is also here and a is also here but here the lambda and a is not present but after that everything is common so if you divide it this part is common for this one and this one but extra thing is here that a and lambda for this one what are the extra that is a and lambda is the extra so it is satisfying all the uh, alphabet which is supported by s that is satisfying by r and more than that this two is extra right clear so which one is superset and which one is subset i think now it is clear to you right now you search the answer now try to find out the answer now t t here is t so t here you have to think that a is there and b is there that is mandatory a and b is mandatory now inside this inside there if you think this is the blank part so here is the a star a star is meaning that it can be lambda or it can be any combination of a means a and b is definite a and b should be there after that it can be a a a b or a a b or any any term any a any number of a can be there but at least a b at least is a b is a there after that any combination of anything right so now try to understand that ki what it is satisfying means at least a b is there right so from here also you can a b is there but but there is the problem that from this string can you generate all the string which is satisfied by here from there you can uh, you can generate like the string that i am uh, writing a string that is from this string you can generate like a a b you can generate it because any combination of a b but uh, from here also you can generate a a b that is fine but from this string you can generate a b b right but from this string you cannot generate a b b because here it is any combination of a means whatever string is generated by this string it is supported by s and it is supported by r also but it is extra more than extra means a t plus some extra thing is there in s and s plus some extra thing is there in r right so that's why this is what is the answer just pause the video and try to understand what will be the answer from here and what is which one is superset and which one is subset i already told that how to understand the superset and subset just try to understand that a greater or equals to b means a is the superset b is the subset so a this one means a is the superset and b is the subset so easily you can find out the answer yes the answer is r l r is the top superset because here extra thing is lambda and a which is not satisfied by this so everything supported by s plus this one here 
and here it is satisfying only the any at least a a or at least a b is there after that any combination of a and b right and here it is satisfying at least a b and after that any combination of a and b inside that any combination of a right so whatever it is satisfying that it is satisfying by a s but plus something more and whatever is satisfying by this it is satisfying by r and plus something more that's why lr is the top superset after that ls after that lt so this is the answer i think from this video and from this one question your all the concept of star plus and how to generate the string how to identify the superset and how to identify the subset it is very clear to you right now i am giving another question to you like a home task try to do this by yourself try to solve this by yourself and watch my next video for the solution so this is like a home task for you just try to solve it and if you are able that is very fine what will be the answer let me know for the question number 2 and if you are not able to understand then please check the next video for the solution of this problem please let me know in the comment section that if it is clear or not what is your doubt please feedback and please share this video to all of your friend and for detail course detail everything is there so i am taking uh, this is my profile i am priyanka chatterjee and you can follow me on an academy also there i am taking class free classes also so follow me in both that is unify study youtube channel and an academy to clear your concept more and if you want to take the subscription of plus courses every day 9 pm 9 to 10 30 pm i am taking the plus courses in an academy so you can take the subscription using my referral code priyanka cs you will get 10% off thank you thank you so much stay tuned with this channel unify study and try to uh do the question which is your homework next question this is your homework i think already result what is the answer it is also shown to you so we will discuss more question and stay tuned check the next video thank you thank you so much bye